Alright, welcome back to an episode of the Gadget Book Club and the Bozak Book Club. Yay, yeah, yeah, yeah. The Vegas are an extremely, extremely special episode because the Vegas are episode number 376. Today it's Friday. And on Fridays, I'm not uh, releasing any, any new episode. So this is why it's so great to make an episode because each episode that I'm making today is straightforward. And so it's closing the gap with episodes that I need to work on. But on each, uh, from Sunday to Thursday, I don't want to choose the very day, Thursday. From Sunday, because from Sunday to Thursday, Thursday, it's um, a remote on the episode. The first episode is also for the day, so it'll be even. And then I can get another. But from uh, Friday and Saturday, straight to the count. And to celebrate this, we are continuing to, we are continuing our journey with the book, Influence of Psychology of Conservation. Yay! We will going to be Kilandi. Kildini. Page 206, and they are getting close, really close to finish the book. So let's go. But those were not uh, to be normal times. For fun thing, Robert Chubb did not uh, govern in the tradition of the Sars, Sars or uh, Stalin, only of the line of uh, oppressive uh, post-war rules, rules were not allowed even a breath of uh, freedom to the masses. He had uh, set them uh, certain rights and uh, choices. And when those uh, now established uh, freedoms uh, were threatened, the people uh, lashed out uh, the way a dog uh, would if someone tried to take, uh, taking a fresh bone from, his mouth, from its mouth. Within hours of the Juntas uh, announcement, announcement Thousands were in the streets, uh, erecting, uh, erecting uh, barricades, uh, confronting arms, uh, troops, surrounding tanks, and defying a uh, confuse. The uprising was so swift, so massive, so unitary in its, in its opposition to any retreat uh, from the games of a uh, glass nose. That after only three and two days, the astonished official, officials the astonished, the astonished official uh, relented, surrounding the, the problem and the pleading for mercy from uh, President Gomacho. Had they been uh, students of history or of psychology, the Fed uh, protos uh, would not have been so surprised by the Tidal wave of, of popular resistance that swallowed uh, the cup. From the vantage point of, of his own discipline, they could have uh, learned in, in a variant lesson. Freedoms once uh, granted uh, will not be relinquished, relinquished without a fight. The lesson applies as well to the politics of family as, for, as, for, as of family as culture. The parent who organizes privileges uh, or uh, enforces the uh, rules uh, erratically invites uh, rebellion, rebelliousness by, uh, by unwittingly, by unwittingly establishing uh, freedoms uh, for the child. The parents who only sometimes yeah. Let's apply this way to the politics of families as the culture. The parents who grants privileges or enforces the rules erratically invites rebelliousness by unwittingly and being unwittingly. Establishing a freedom uh, for the child. The parents will only sometimes uh, prohibit uh, between uh, meal sweets, meal sweets, might create for the child the freedom to have such uh, snacks. At that point, enforcing the rule becomes a much more difficult and explosive uh, matter because the child is no longer merely lacking a never possessed a right, but is losing again, but losing, but is losing an established, established one. 
as we have seen in the case of political freedoms and especially coming to the present discussion, chocolate chip cookies, people see a thing as more desirable than it has recently become less available as and when it has been scarce, scarce and all along. We should not be surprised then. The research shows that uh, parents who enforce uh, discipline uh, inconsistently produce uh, generally rebellious uh, children. Let's look back to the cookie study for another insight into the way we react to scarcity. scarcity. We have already seen uh, from the results of that uh, study that scarce uh, cookies uh, are rated uh, higher than abundant cookies. And what really scares the cookies? Or at a dire still. Staying uh, with the newly scale cookies uh, now, there was a certain cookies that was uh, the highest rated of all. Those that become those, those that became less available because of a uh, demand for them. Remember that in the experiment, uh, the participants who experienced a uh, new scarcity had been given a jar of 10 cookies uh, that was then replaced with a jar of only two cookies, two cookies. Actually, the researchers uh, did this in one of two ways. To certain, to certain participants, it was explained that some of their uh, cookies had to be given away to other uh, retailers to supply the demand for cookies in the study. To another set of participants, it was explained that the number of cookies had be to be reduced because the researcher had uh, simply made a mistake and given them the wrong journey initially. initially. The results uh, showed that those whose cookies became a uh, scare for the process of social demand liked them significantly more than those whose cookies became a uh, scarce by mistake. In fact, in fact, the cookies made less available uh, for social demand for the cookies. In fact, the cookies made less available for social demand uh, were rated the most desirable of any in the study. This finding highlights uh, the importance of competition in the pursuit of limited uh, resources, resources. Not only do we want the same items uh, more when it, when it scales, when it scales, we want it uh, most when we are in a competition for it. Adversitors uh, often try to exploit this uh, tendency in, in us, in the reds. We learn that a uh, popular demand for an item is so great that we must hurry to buy. When we see a crowd uh, pressing against the doors of a store before the start of a sale, or we watch a flock of hands uh, quickly deplete a supermarket uh, shelf of a product. Of a product. There is more to such images than the idea of uh, ordinary social proof. The message is not just that the product is good because the other people feel, think so, but also that we are in direct uh, competition with those people for it. The feeling of uh, being in competition for scarce uh, resources is powerfully motivating uh, properties, uh, properties. The order of an uh, indifferent lover surges uh, with the opinions of a, ra of a raven, raven. It is often for reasons of strategy, therefore, that romantic partners uh, reveal or invent the attention of, an, of a new admi admi admirer. Ad my Says people are uh, taught to play the same game which with in the in the decisive uh, customers. For example, a realtor who is uh, trying to sell a house to a to a fence sitting uh, prospect, we sometimes uh, call the prospect with uh, news of another potential buyer who has seen the house enacted and is scheduled uh, scheduled to return the following day to talk about terms, to talk about terms. When a body fabricated, the new bidder is a commonly described as an outsider with a plenty of money. 
an out of state investor uh, buying this for tax purposes. And the physical and his, and his wife moving into town, our favorites. The tactic, the tactic called in some so called the goosing game, goosing game of the fans. And work the state and leave well. The thought of losing out of a uh, out to a live alive frequently turns a vial from a hesitant to see lose. There is something uh, almost a uh, physical about the desire to have a con tested item. Shoppers that a uh, big close out or a uh, bargain sales and report being uh, cut up emotionally in the event. Charged by the crush of competitors, competitors, this government struggle to claim merchandise they would otherwise uh, dis disdain. Such behavior brings that brings to mind the as a such behavior brings to mind the feeling frenzy of wild, indiscriminate eating among animal 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 groups. Commercial fishermen uh, exploit this uh, phenomenon by throwing a quantity of loose loose bait. To large uh, schools uh, of of to large schools of certain fish. Soon as the water is a uh, roiling uh, expense of crushing, finds the uh, snapping marks uh, competing for for the food, competing for the food. At this point, the fishermen uh, save time and money by dropping unbaited uh, lines, unbaiting unbaited uh, lines. Into the water, since the uh, crazy fish will bite uh, freakishly, 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 F E R O C I O U S L Y, at anything now, including a uh, bare metal looks. And guys, guess what? This is the end of the episode. So, guys, thank you much for joining me. I'm going to put the fact that you choose to so that you choose. Universal time with me, and I can't wait to see you all tomorrow. Episode of the Gun Book on the Gun Book made about the Gun Book. Until then, I've got time to consider. And bye, have a great start of the week. Time now, it's 8 31, 2nd of September 2022.